Six whole eggs, four bowls of oatmeal, mixed fruit juice, total of eight scoops of protein, half a liter of ice cream with every meal. Any sugary cereal, grilled chicken, burger, extra large meat lovers pizza, two apple pies, lasagna, yogurt, granola, peanut butter jelly time. Yes, sir. <laughs> We're on 8.30 in the morning just to show you and welcome back to my new video. This time we're gonna do full day of feeding of man himself Larry Wheels. So if you don't know who Larry Wheels is probably you're living under the rock. He is uh, one of the strongest human beings in the world. Uh, he was a bodybuilder then he was a power lifter and now with this diet that I'm gonna show you today, he tries to accomplish his dreams to be a strongman. This diet will be like really, really hard to kick today because I am currently bulking and I'm eating 6,000 calories and I am struggling every day. So before we start this video, guys, please hit that subscribe button. Now let's just begin the struggle and I will show you what he's gonna have oatmeal, four packages and this is 170 grams of an oatmeal and we have a six whole eggs. Also with every meal or every other, I don't know, he's gonna get a fruit juice and 30 grams of honey, four layers of this fruit juice. This is gonna be a struggle guys. Eggs are gone. Oh, 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 oh. too strong. Oh, let's go. Oatmeal smashed. And the last thing, which I don't get, Larry, he's gonna have a not one, not two, but three, three scoops of whey protein. What I don't get, why you don't just put that in your oatmeal? Lowering the volume, oatmeal tastes much better. That's the point. Two, three scoops, guys. Three scoops. What in the earth? Don't let this breakfast fool you guys, because after this meal we actually starting with this crazy diet. My stomach won't be my friend today, that's for sure, I already feel it. Anyway, I'm gonna rest for a, maybe only one hour, two hours, then I'm gonna have a next meal, that's gonna be a pre-workout meal, and then we are off to the gym, guys. Cookie crisp, roughly half a bag, full fat milk, more calories. I started adding half a liter of ice cream with every meal. This is not a healthy diet, and this is not sustainable diet. You'll see as the day goes on, this is not a healthy diet. This is temporary. From this meal, we're starting to eating unhealthy throughout this day. So we're gonna have, I consider this meal also as a cheat meal, but we have a three like really cheat meals after this one. Half bag of these cookie crisps with the full fat milks and a shake, half liter of ice cream and two scoops once again of whey protein. Since I don't have a blender, I uh, did like my ice cream inside of this cereal. So just gonna dig into this meal and then hopefully do some training. Fun fact, when you're bulking, even this kind of delicious food don't taste so good. That was a rhyme also. <laughs> Off to the gym, so let's hit that workout. I see you in the gym, guys. <laughs>
All right, third meal of the day, grilled chicken burger. We have some normal seeds and potato fries. Grilled chicken, burger or a sandwich, normal pommes out here. We back in my battery. It's currently going to die, so I must be quick. We are starting with the cheat meals. Burger me, it's called. As you can see, and I took grilled chicken. Yeah, this is actually pretty much high in calories. Okay, focus. But looks really nice. I'm gonna put macros that I had today for this whole day. I'm copying his diet, but in the end of the day with my groceries I'm gonna put, but this is gonna be for sure around 10,000 calories. So let's just dig into this. Also after that we have a fries. Mm. But it is pretty nice with some barbecue sauce, some vegetables inside. The burger is down and I have this ketchup all over my car, as always. And my battery is just gonna die, so I'm gonna dig into these fries and I'm gonna show you when I'm finished. I literally left like two, three pieces inside and if you watch his video, he has like two, three pieces overall. So don't want to eat because I really don't want to eat anymore and we still have a three more meals to go and I'm gonna say three toughest meal because all of three of them are like cheat meals. So this is gonna be a tough one guys. This is definitely gonna be a tough one. So let's go home and make a next meal probably. I almost forgot. After that meal he also had once again half liter of ice cream and two scoops of whey protein. So it's already three, seven scoops of protein until now. About one hour next meal, man. Extra large meat lovers pizza, two apple pies, lasagna, yogurt, granola, um, and also some fruit juice. Even though this looks really awesome, but the struggle is really real. So, what is with the lighting here? Actually, the next two meals are in front of us. So I'm gonna explain you briefly right now. After that burger, he will have a uh, next meal. That meal would be large pizza plus dessert. As he said, with every cheat meal he has a dessert. But uh, he had in this video really, really small pizza. Uh, mine is like 500 grams. So it's, I think, even double than his. And I'm not gonna have a dessert with this because I already counted calories and I'm already, when I finish this day, over 10,000 calories. So I don't need to have a dessert with this and I don't want to be honest. I'm really like sick of food. But I'm gonna incorporate these two meals uh, in one. So th that's gonna be pizza with half of liter of fruit juice once again. After that, once again, cheat meal, like two hours after. Lasagna, guys. <laughs> My God, unbelievable, what is with the diet? I mean, uh, lasagna with uh, dessert, once again, of course. And that dessert would be some Greek yogurt with granola. And his was also really, really like small Greek yogurt. Uh, <laughs> but I have a like, this is also like 400 grams, a big packaging with the chocolate granola and with some like cherries inside. So this is also, I think double in calories that he actually ate. That's why I don't want to incorporate one more like sweet stuff, dessert in this. Furthermore, while I'm doing these two meals in one, because I fell asleep a little bit and it's currently 5.30, so I'm not running late, but the biggest problem of them all is that I have a soccer training in a two and a half hours. It's okay to go to the gym, you know, you have a much more strength and everything. You don't feel so good, but the strength is there. When you play soccer with like 8,000 calories in, in, in yourself, then that's 
really not an optimal thing and I think I'm gonna throw up in the training I think I'm gonna need to say something that I have a uh, stomach ache or something like that because that's not gonna work so let's just like smash this if it's possible I think this meal is over at least two, two and two and a half thousand calories in my estimation I don't know but it's not so good mm. Mm. this pizza is surprisingly good Finished pretty fast because it was really delicious. Now I'm drinking. Oh, but, but, uh, what, is, but, what is this? Uh, off to lasagnas. I'm dying. Every meal is a struggle. My stomach's always bursting and extremely full and tight. That's how I know I'm gaining. People don't try this at well. Greek yogurt with some fruit and with the granola. <sighs> that was five meals in the book and it's currently 5.46. I have a training in 8 o'clock, so the last meal is gonna be somewhere around hopefully 10 o'clock. If I survive the training. Two thousand years later. All right, all right. You're not gonna believe what actually happened. I mean, you can already assume, but <laughs> what happened is that that currently is where is my mobile phone? Nine eight. I had a training at eight o'clock, but. I actually fell asleep for a little bit and slept over my training so there's gonna be a punishment and by punishment I, I mean financial so this day has been expensive just because of the food and now because of the punishment so please if you still didn't up till now hit that subscribe button guys at least for that anyway the last meal is in front of me since it's a little bit earlier, I want to eat this and then go to the bed. So the last meal... It is peanut butter jelly time. Yes, sir. Three peanut butter jelly sandwiches and half a liter of ice cream once again and two scoops of whey protein. Give me a second to smash this meal. gonna lie this was the easiest meal to eat up until now maybe it's because of the nap I don't know we have half a liter more of to eat this ice cream so yeah let's just my god literally drank this because it was really like liquidy furthermore to go just a shake with two scoops of whey which I like, I think I, I hit the nine scoops today. And I have ice cream like in the morning, something on my face and you don't want to tell me that. I can only imagine the amount of protein that I ate today. And I've been into toilet for at least four times today. I did it. I will put the calories and macros totals with my groceries, but I must admit it was really, really similar to, to his on the screen right now. So as I saw, I think over 10,000, almost 500 grams of protein, over one kilo of carbs and a lots of fats also. So uh, definitely not gonna sleep so good today and I'm gonna feel so good tomorrow. Anyways, he said on the, on the end of the video and everybody like agrees with him that this is not first of all healthy diet this is not sustainable diet 100 percent do not recommend eating this dirty on a daily it's not healthy i made this video just for fun because i'm currently also booking and i just wanted to see how i'm gonna feel after 10,000 calories because i'm currently eating six and i'm feeling like a crap so after this 10,000, i i'm feeling even more shittier he knows that it's unhealthy but he won't achieve his goals and yeah, very good from him. I For him, I think 
he's an absolute man animal i think that he can actually compete in the uh strong men's and yeah chase your dreams guys hit your goals whatever it takes anyway i'm gonna wrap this video up finally here because i'm really tired and i feel uh all over the place so if you like this video guys don't forget to hit those like buttons because youtube has these algorithms when you like my videos uh, then i'm more like foundable etc etc so we are all happy if you're new to the channel guys and you still didn't subscribe if you're new to the channel guys at least for an effort and for these financial things and punishments and everything hit that subscribe button this is like hit that subscribe button comment down below what you want to see so thank you guys once again for watching and i see you as always on my next video Almost like Larry Wheels.